flips open and catches the wind like a sailboat. Winter Park architect John Drake normally designs opulent hotels, but for two years he's had one obsession, a windmill. It started on a mission trip with Summit Church to the African country of Malawi. Drake was shocked to learn the average diet of a Malawian is just 300 calories a day. HIV affects 14 percent of the population, but 100 percent of the population was affected by hunger. Drake says Malawian farmers don't have the resources to irrigate their crops, and that's why there's so little food. So he threw himself into designing a windmill that would pump water and that could be built with materials readily available to even the poorest farmers. So instead of getting one growing season a year, they can get two to three growing seasons and stabilize the food supply of Malawi. Drake says what makes this windmill so different is that it's made entirely from materials that the Africans can find right in their own village. That also means they'll be able to maintain it. Drake returned to Malawi with a nonprofit ministry called Children of the Nations and led a team of volunteers in building a prototype of his windmill there. What do you think? Is this windmill going to work? Yeah, I believe this is going to work. The windmill is made from bamboo, PVC pipe, grain sacks, and discarded bicycle tires, and it actually works. Drake hopes eventually farmers all over Africa can be trained to reproduce the windmill. His ultimate dream is to see children like these. Grow into healthy adults who never know hunger. Everybody can do something. Um, everybody has gifts. Everybody has talents. And that is a good lesson for all of us. Amanda Ober reporting West 2 News.